Good morning, all my fellow savvy, knowledgeable, sagacious MAGA supporters. Let's start out with Market Watch. Look at this headline. U.S. stock market extends record-setting rise in Biden's first full day in office. Of course, they're talking about today, 21 January 2021, Uncle Joe's first full day in office. Now, when I first saw this story, the stock market was still open, but I decided to wait until after the stock market closed here in Hawaii. So, let's take a look at the story. How are the stock benchmarks performing? The Dow Jones Industrial Average DJIA rose 34 points or 0.1% to 31,223 after hitting an intraday record peak at 31,272.22. The S&P index, SPX, was up 6 points or less than 0.2% at around 3,858. The NASDAQ Composite Index, COMP, climbed 77 points or 0.6% to reach 15,535, setting an intraday record at 13,544.47. Let's go to one more story. This from The Street. Stocks set records as Wall Street looks to Biden for more stimulus. Stocks were higher Thursday after the benchmark indexes set intraday records as investors look to more support for the struggling U.S. economy and improved vaccine distribution from the Biden administration. Well, folks, you've just seen two stories from the legacy media, and they'd like you to think, who are you going to believe, me or your lying lies? Why would I make that comment? Well, let's go to one more legacy media news site. This from CNN Business. Take a look, folks. Dow Jones was down today 12.37 points or 0.04%. Let's take a look at today's date. There it is. It's 11.31 Hawaiian time, the 21st of January, 2021. The Dow did indeed fall 12 points after, I guess, these two stories were written. I guess they wrote the story, well, I know they wrote the stories before the Dow closed. They would have you believe that Uncle Joe is doing just fine. Uncle Joe is not working to improve the U.S. economy. The U.S. economy worked wonderfully under President Donald Trump. For three years, the economy boomed. Then, Democratic governors shut down the economy, wouldn't let people go to work, had people wearing masks, wouldn't let them go to barber shops or beauty shops, wouldn't them go to see sports games, wouldn't even let them buy stuffs at their local mom and pa shop, but if you wanted to buy from a big box store, that was okay. Let's destroy the local economy, but keep the big box stores open. I think today's little dip is a harbinger of things to come. Uncle Joe is not interested in the economy. He's already said he's going to close down the pipeline and the thousands of jobs in both the United States and Canada that comes from that. And let's not forget, a pipeline moves oil far less expensively and far more economically 
am far more ecologically sound than shipping it by boat or truck or train. So, Uncle Joe, he's not being economically or ecologically sound in his policy decisions so far. Do you really think it's going to get any better in the future? Good luck with that. <laughs>